Okay, I'm GeoDav, and what I'm going to try and show here is what you're going to have to do when using some of the mix mode stuff and trying to retarget the animations. Now, most of you who have interested in Miximo or Fuse will have noticed and have got the. Uh, let's, let me just see if I can get it up there. Marketplace. There we go. Miximo animation pack. Okay, we'll have a quick scan at that in a minute. Now, if you go to Miximo, right, let's see if we can get this up. Uh, I, this is a character that I've been messing about with yeah. and you get lots of little sort of like animations there's quite a few that are free to play with okay now if you're wanting things like this non-playing character or basic shooter it's going to cost you quite a few credits okay but it's not be all end all okay these things make make it very easy to do and trust me I've tried uh, retargeting BVH files in Blender and in other programs when I've had the chance and it's not easy Miximo if you're using their animations with their characters it is really a piece of uh, no I'll beep that out anyway so so what we're going to do is have a quick look right so you, you, you're down here uh, gun I don't really want the gun gun star but hey you know, let's go I mean, once you've logged in I mean I, I'm logged in and I've got that long dress female that's playing there so just click double click on it and eventually this comes up and believe it or not that's the unity player uh, not unreal but hey ho so here you can you can edit your character you can which way was it ah oh, that was it uh, if I wanted, I can switch to the other character that I've got here, which is shown on the other video. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. There we go. Doesn't he look really, really roughy tufty? Yeah, okay. So then all you got to do is go on to your download, it'll check out because it's this one's free and you go here and it's telling you not yet downloaded not yet downloaded and all i'm going to do is just take this dancing one include the skin i'm going to go for fbx and download it now it can take a few minutes as you can see i've done the samba one there we go plonk Smashing. Now let's see if I can get where I want to be. It's not quite finished. There we go. Right, not there. Right, into me downloads. Gungan style. Uh, I'm gonna just dump that over into my fuse. So that's where I've got everything else. Uh, in Unreal Editor. Now here I've got all the Miximo pack there and in here I have my your man there. Let's see I think that's from the locomotion pack. Yeah as you can see here they've all got funny names but hey ho and that's when I was trying it from Blender and that's the Samba now if I open this up it's not going to play because oh, come on there we 
go. And I know I've said in some cases, oh, you can get these bits here where they've got extra names on. I'll show you that in a minute. And she's doing a nice little sample there. So what we're going to do is I'm going to make another folder here for Ganon, whatever it is. And I'm just going to import. Uh, let's see if I can find the Ganon style. Now you could try just importing the animation. I haven't got that to work, so let's just go into the advanced options. I'm just going to import the skeletal mesh. Uh, let's leave the materials out for the moment because I've already got them. So we'll just import. But it should just give me the mesh and the animation, he said, hopefully. So, ta -ta 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 -ta. yeah, this is where I got a little bit worried. For the bind pose thing. Now, if I look on here, now it won't let me double click on it. You can see the names are fine. Okay, and... She is now doing the gum gum, yeah, or whatever you want to call it. Save now. Okay, so that's fine. The skeleton's fine. Now, one thing I have noticed: if I pick another skeleton, it might just be me. It's not coming in nicely. So, in one of my posts, I said, "Yeah." smashing do that on the goblin and that's just exactly what I'm going to do now save selected right click on the animation retarget anim assets now where are we where's mr. goblin there he is select the goblin press select and yeah it says fine. I say open and lucky here. Hey, you've got Mr. Goblin doing the gang gang. And I'll be very honest, I don't like that. It looks better do, doing the samba. Here we go. Now, it's not as good as uh, Taylor's video, but. Uh, I'm not even going to try and put music to this because I live in Germany and there's a certain part of the government or whatever that gets really peaked with people using music so, and gets everything blocked. So we'll just leave it at that. That's how easy it is. Remember using the Mixamo Anims. Now, I haven't got any, uh, it does look silly, doesn't it? <coughs> but, uh, yeah, I, I haven't tried this with any other, let's say, BVH files. In fact, let's see, if we look at Blender, I'll show you why. Because when I imported this into Blender, uh, let's just go into Edit. I imported it into Blender, rescaled everything and all the rest of it, and I got all these Mixab Mold Rig names put on front of my, the, the bones, which was slightly annoying, but hey ho. Now, if I want, I suppose, let's just do that again. Let's go for the Samba, because I don't like Gat Gat. Uh, Retarget, let's see if this works, and. Uh, there we go. That's it. That's the one. That's the one that I imported from Blender. Okay. And yep. Open and 
Now it's not working, and I'll tell you the good chance. Let's see. Uh, show bones. Now it's not working, and I believe the reason for this. The retargeting is yes, it's very nice, but because the name of the bones don't match the name of the bones from the original file, the retargeting is not going to work. Okay. Now, as you saw with the with the goblin, the goblin's a little guy. Have we got any big guys? I saw that big monster thing somewhere. Where is it? Uh, go on. Is that that big thing with horns? There it is. Right, let me just make sure I get the name. Okay, Mall G. So we go into the Samba. Retarget that. Right, that's one. I select. Done. Open. Come on. Human. Now this is going to yeah because compiling shaders so we got this big guy dancing around doing the samba how sad is that yeah what I'm gonna do here it's just a little something I list Let's see if we can. Uh, unfortunately, because it's compiling the shaders, it's getting a bit jerky. Uh, let's see. I want him. I want to use an animation asset. And no, not that one. Well, let's dump him. Let's put her in there. And she can go do the dance. And let's see if we can find that guy. Just pull him out here. Just for a size comparison. I don't even know whether this is going to work, you know. But, uh, there we go, and Mr. Goblin, now I want the mesh, and look, the Goblin's not actually that small is he? Right, so we'll, and we'll use, again use a menu, this time we'll make him do the gun gun. If I can find it, there we go. And make this screen as big as possible. I don't even know whether this work, works or not, so. Uh, yay, look at that. Now, obviously, what you really want to do here is make a matinee track for all of them so they, they go go from doing the, the samba into doing the uh, the gun gun and then the jazz tan dance and all the rest of it but hey ho it works and it doesn't look pretty because I've got my settings right down okay so no, that's not going to work like that come on 